Hi guys, welcome back. Last time I showed you how to make a cake stand out of a bobbin from sewing. It was like one of these little guys. Well, this time I'm going to show you how to make it out of one of these little bottles. Okay, usually they come in with like eye drops or something like that. They come in different sizes, different colors, and you can go from there. So, the first thing I did was, I don't have any more of the white bottles, so I have to show you on here. But the first thing I did was, I took this part here which would be this base here and I cut it right there and I just went ahead and started it slowly be careful so you don't cut through your hand and keep your fingers far far away from it and as long as you're using a pretty decent blade it should cut it pretty easily okay and if you have leftovers just go right back around and cut it off. Keep your fingers away from the blade. And most of the time it comes off pretty smoothly, but I kind of went off the edge a little bit there. So you'll end up with something like this. Then you want to take it and go on 400 grit sandpaper and just sand the bottom flat so it's not wonky or anything. All right, after that, then you want to take the bottom of your container. I'm going to go ahead and just cut it. It doesn't have to be straight when you do that because what you're going to do is you're going to take micro tip scissors and I don't know if you can see like that pretend like curve that they have going on there. You want to go down in there and you want to follow that all the way around. Okay, if you went crooked, try to straighten it up a little bit. And again, you can sand that the same way. All right, once it's sanded, then you have yourself a tray. And you wanna go ahead and glue that right on top of there. Now this one's a little taller, so I don't really like that as much. So what I went ahead and did, I cut the top off, and then you can glue it down like that. All right, but I'm going to show you with the white one. I'm going to take a little bit of hot glue. You can use crazy glue as well. It's completely up to you. I'm going to try and fill in that center just a tiny bit there. Just flatten it out as much as I can with the hot glue. Then I'm going to take this and I'm going to stick it on there just like that and let it cool down. All right, and then you have yourself a cake tray. You can just put your cake on there and set it just like that. And there it is with the blue one. All right, so that's it for making cake trays. Thanks a lot for watching. Hopefully this was helpful, and I will see you in the next video. If you want to download some miniature dollhouse templates, there is free printables, as in floor printables, backsplashes, furniture templates, you know, all of that on my website under dollhousetutorials.com. So check it out. It's all free and hopefully it's helpful and I'll see you next time. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.